Alexander had a great game. He had 28 points. I mean, he was he was terrific. And that three he hit was huge. And Oklahoma made a, a significant mistake not getting out to him and making him put the ball on the floor and get inside that line and have a contested two instead of an open three. But you, you have to give them a lot of credit. I, I thought North, you know, we called that. That was a 12-5 upset that we thought would happen. But at the same time, it's one thing to think it's going to happen. It's another thing for North Dakota State to actually make it happen against a very good Oklahoma team that can really score. Defensively, North Dakota State did a good job, too, on them. Yeah, we spent a lot of time, and understandably so, talking about Braun and Bjorklund. It was Lawrence Alexander who put up a career-high 28 points and hit just a gargantuan shot that ended up putting the game in overtime. And, and North Dakota State had more turnovers than Oklahoma, but, but North Dakota State capitalized on Oklahoma's turnovers to score points off of them. Oklahoma did not return the favor, and that was an issue in the game. They did a terrific job. North Dakota State, the Bison, did a terrific job <laughs> from the free throw line as well. They go 20-22 from the free throw line. And in, a, in an overtime game, that's a big deal. All they had to do was win a game in the tournament, first one they've won, and you get on board with the Bison instead of the Bison. They're an excellent <laughs> scoring team. <laughs> and I they can really score. Uh, and after the game, you said they were celebrating. <laughs> They're uh, also celebrating.